a Meccano 9 speed and reverse gearbox by Andreas Concoli. Um, this is in theory a very good gearbox but I actually found it um, rather disappointing, difficult to put together and it, it doesn't work very well. Um, also I found these frames to move the gears um, very much overkill um, so I did a redesign on that. Um, there are also some mistakes in the manual, though none of them are that, that serious. Um, but anyway, let's have a look at the model. So here we have the actual gearbox, and I've replaced those awkward frames with just uh, cranks. Um, and they are not allowed to turn on their rod. So they just uh, grip the these three gears here, and these four gears down here. All those gears are on a key rod. Um, using a key bolt which means they can slide along the rod but they still have to turn with the rod. Um, at the moment it's in reverse gear there's an idle op uh, pinion here um, I won't show that um, uh, the forward, first forward gear is um, get it across is there so that's a one to one ratio uh, if I turn that it now goes down on that gear for a 2 to 1 ratio. Um, move that across a bit, we get a 1 to 3 ratio. And finally, there's a 3 to 1 ratio. Let's move that back and move this more over to there. Right, now that's um, a 1 to 3 ratio. So with that gear also, we get um, 2 to 3. I hope I'm getting this right. <laughs> and then the very highest ratio here, that's, um, that's 1 to 9. And uh, oh dear, let's get that out of the way. Um, and finally, 1 to 1. So that's um, 1 to 3 and 3 to 1, and they effectively cancel out for 1 to 1 and uh, then we can move this over right to the end to a uh, 4 to 1 gear, gear ratio put that back and that's a pretty that's um, an 8 to 1 ratio move this along we get um, 4 to 3 and finally the lowest ratio of the lot 12 to 1 Um, the only other thing I'd say about this is that this key, key rod here and this coupling to a normal rod is a, a bit um, a bit over enthusiastic. What t it doesn't turn very well because the rod's got some slight. Um, it's not quite true, um, and I think really putting everything on two rods like this is a, is a bit much and it would be better to have the whole thing on three rods uh, just to make it um, a bit freer running.